<laughs> she is taking photos of uh, lots, lots of famous people from Albert Einstein and Edith Piaf to Twiggy and Joanna Lumley. And now Marilyn Stafford is showing a selection of her photos at the Hull International Photography Festival. Her pictures of the fashion industry are on display in one of the city's shopping centres. She's been speaking to our culture correspondent, Amory Tasker. So Marilyn, you've taken thousands and thousands of photos over the years. How do you feel about this selection being shown in a shopping centre? I'm just delighted. I'm over the moon. And I think it was rather genial to, to bring the fashion into the mall. Just to explain to people watching how you started out as a photographer. I didn't really start out as a photographer. I wanted to be an actress. I went to a drama school with Paul Newman and Joel Gray and made friends with people who were making documentary films. And then one day they were going to do a documentary on Albert Einstein. And I was given suddenly a 35 millimeter camera, which I'd never seen before, and uh, said, OK, you're the stills lady on this shoot. As it turned out, I started at the top with Albert Einstein. I ended with the top with Indira Gandhi. I think that's not bad for somebody who just wanted to be the great American actress. That's an incredible first assignment, isn't it? He was a marvelous man. And he was wearing slouchy trousers and an old kind of sweatshirt. He was, he was you know, very friendly. Out of all of these famous people that you've had contact with and photographed, Who's the most interesting? Everybody is interesting, really, um, no matter who they are. There, there is something there in absolutely everybody, so I can't say who is a favorite. I adored Joanna Lumley. When I photographed her, she was a model. But look what she has become, a national icon, really. When you were working in this industry, what was your experience as a woman? When I came to England in the mid-60s, I think there were two women news photographers. Uh, there are more women now. I don't know if they're getting equal pay with men. I think to a certain extent they're getting pushed around a lot by men. And that is one of the reasons why I've set up a photo award for women documentary photographers. And showing your work outside of London to a new audience is perhaps another way of inspiring the next generation. I hope so. I really hope so, because you really are cracking into men's territory. But me too. <laughs> we will all be there. We're all fighting together. And that exhibition of uh, Marilyn's photos is on until the 28th of October. Transpennine Express have extended.